Russian President Vladimir Putin has set his military aims for 2023 in a meeting on Wednesday. With 15,000 military officials attending by video conference, Russia's defense minister Sergei Shoigu has called for his country's military to be expanded. Now, the Institute for the Study of War has previously observed that the Kremlin has been setting information conditions for a protraction of the war in Ukraine since the summer following Russian forces' dismal failures to secure and retain their primary objectives. Russian President Vladimir Putin's objectives in Ukraine have not changed, according to Ukrainian officials, and the Institute for the Study of War's assessment based on Kremlin statements and actions. The think tank says Ukraine's President Volodymyr Zelensky frontline visit to Bakhmut on the day that marked 300 days of war is undermining an ongoing Kremlin information operation intended to present Russian President Vladimir Putin as an involved war leader. Now, Bakhmut has been the prime target of the Russian assault for months now. The pace of Russian advances in the Bakhmut area has not increased in previous weeks. The Institute for the Study of War assesses that Russian troops have gained a total of 192 square kilometers in the Bakhmut area between the 1st of October and the 20th of December. The UK Defense Ministry adds that intense combat has occurred in the Bakhmut sector since June, but the front lines have primarily been in open country around the eastern approaches to the town. So the Institute for the Study of War adds that Russian sources will likely continue to try to falsely assert that Russian forces are taking a notable amount of territory in the Bakhmut area.